If you're trying to group some rows in Excel, uh, the way you can do that is by hitting Alt D G G, and that brings up this menu that allows you to group either rows or columns. So we'll hit uh, rows here, and you can see that that will add this um, little menu bar over here that shows you that you've got a grouped row here on seven. So if you hit this plus or minus bar, it will collapse that row, and you can hide or unhide it. Um, so that, and you can do this with multiple rows as well. Um, so the way to, to then ungroup this is to hit all D, G, U, and it brings up this same box, and you can select rows and hit OK, and now you've ungrouped that. So instead of working with the dialog box, if you want to make this um, an easier kind of shortcut, then just select the entire row before you hit all D, G, G, okay, and then it'll automatically know that you want to group some rows here. Um, and then the same thing applies if you want to ungroup these. Just select the rows that are grouped and hit Alt D G U to ungroup them. Um, so you can also group columns the same way. If I select this group of three columns here and and, um, and then highlight them, and if I now go Alt D G G, it will group those for me. So I can now expand and collapse them using this plus and minus. I can also um, select them and hit Alt D G U to ungroup them, and that will ungroup the selected uh, columns. Um, so this is, I think, a better way of concealing rows or columns than hiding them. You know, if you watch the other video on hiding rows or columns, the you know to hide a column, you would hit Control Zero, and that would now hide this column, but the problem is that this is kind of hard to see, right? So you might forget that this is hidden here. Um, if you send this worksheet to someone else, they may not know. So I prefer to group them when 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 possible, because now it's you get a couple of things. Um, number one, it's easy to expand and contract this grouping if you if you need to, uh, and two, it's it's kind of easy to see that this is grouped because it gives you these options here to, you know, to show you that you've got something that's hidden. So it's a lot more user friendly to have it this way, in my opinion. Um, but you know, this is a matter of preference. But the shortcuts that you want to remember basically are Alt D G U, or sorry, Alt D G G to group, and then Alt D G U to ungroup either with rows or columns selected. Mm -hmm.